guys, I'm Veronica, I'm Vanessa, and, and you're watching Food Truck Fanatics on Awesomeness TV. So we're here with Lauren from the Tropic Truck, and we're about to put our own spin on their delicious food. So Lauren, can you tell us what makes your food truck different from the other food trucks here in LA? Yeah, so we do a hybrid of Caribbean food and comfort food. So we do jerk chicken quesadillas, Ooh. crazy fish, seafood combinations. So what's your favorite food here and what's the most popular dish here? Definitely the mahi-mahi bowl. Yeah. It's really fresh and it's got my favorite plantains in it. <gasps> I love plantains. They're my favorite. <laughs> yes, so all of that sounds good. I'm excited to try and make this. So let's hop on the truck right now. So we're here on the Tropic truck and it's blue and it looks tropical already. <laughs> so Lauren, can you show us around? Yeah, sure. This is our um, this is our cold line. We keep everything refrigerated up here. So we have uh, you know our fresh pico de gallo, our limes, our avocados, our plantains we're gonna fry, our cheese. This is the plancha, it's very important. This is what we're gonna cook the fish on. These are our rice cookers, we make a lot of rice. So on the other food trucks we've been on, it's been a lot of men who have been working on there. So it's really cool to see a lovely lady like yeah. you working here. And so you've come up with all the recipes mm -hmm. yourself? Yeah, they've evolved quite a bit from the beginning, um, but now they're dialed in and perfect. So you said something about the mahi-mahi bowl, and so we want to learn how to make that. Can you show us how to yeah. do it? So the first thing we're going to have to do is fry the plantains. <gasps> plantains! <laughs> Let's do it! Oh my. Oh. Almost make a fist so that you don't cut your fingers, you know, like oh. that. And then you're just gonna slice them like that. You wanna try? Yeah. Okay. A little more? Or is that no, good? that's good, okay. that's good. And then I'll show you the next thing we do is um, we're gonna take it, see these little uh, lines? You know, it's really similar to a banana. So you're just gonna pick one that looks good. Wait, what is the difference between plantains and bananas? Well, they call plantains like the big banana. They're, they're family. There's not oh. a big difference. They just grow larger. Okay, and then so you want to slice it? We're just going to cut it like this. Good. Someone want to toss them in the fry basket? Okay. I'm so excited. Okay, I think they're ready. All right. Watch out, it's hot. There we go. Those look yummy. They smell delicious. You guys ready to make some fish now? Yes! yes. So we're gonna season the fish with this blackening seasoning. Okay. okay. You guys wanna do it? Sure. Just coat it pretty well. Coat it pretty yeah, well. Don't okay. worry, you won't, you won't put too much. You might put too little. There you go, there you go, yeah. there you go. Mm, it smells very spice worthy. <laughs> All right, let's put it on the grill. Here we go. Oh! Okay. So we'll give it like 20 more seconds, then you can flip it and then put the bowl on top. So why are we putting the bowl on top? It's steaming it. So okay. it's steaming it and searing it on the outside at the same time. Nice. Yum. Okay. <gasps> you got it. Nice. Yum. All right, so let's just put this on here for just a second. Then we're going to take it off. One of you guys is going to put some moho on it. Okay. I'll put moho. Or we're going to... Put lots of it on it and then it'll be done. Just to seal in like that last bit of moisture. Everyone makes their own kind of moho. It's, it's like a, yeah, like a limey sauce. Just coat it. That looks good, that looks good. Like that? Perfect, now that's when the magic happens. Oh, the oh. magic. Now when it starts to split a little bit like this, then yeah. you know it's done. Oh, okay, secret, guys. It's fish splits, that's when you know it's done. Okay. Wow, I feel like a pro. Okay, here we go. So first thing, let's grab a bowl. We're gonna put rice in it. Rice. So this rice, it's a uh, saffron rice. And saffron is what? It's from a flower that only lives for one day. And um, a it's flower really, that only lives yeah, for it's, one it's a day. Crazy, it's a crazy spice, and it's expensive. And you only need like a tiny bit, and it's really strong. Put like a little for the bed of the bowl, basically. Okay. Because we're still going to put the fish in there and some beans like that? and the plantains. Perfect. So next thing we're going to do is we're going to put some uh, black beans on it. Is that enough? Yeah, perfect. Yay! Next we're going to put some plantains around the side of the bowl. The way we like to do it is around in a circle. So like every bite you get a plantain. And then the next thing I like to put in it <gasps> is... Yeah. Pico on everything in this truck. Yes. That's the rule. That's 
So we put a cool. bunch of pico on the side, and then we make some um, this limey slaw because it kind of cools everything off. We put a little bit of that on the side. And then next, we're going to go ahead and put the fish on. Who wants to do that? I'll do it. How do I put it on? Uh, you can use a spatula or your hands, whatever you feel most comfortable with. We're going to put a little bit of a lime on here. And then last is this. <gasps> Avocado! Yes. So obviously, it's all about presentation here on the Tropic Trek. Look at that. It looks beautiful. It looks so good, and it yummy. smells. Delicious. It smells like a tropical vacation that I'm ready to sink my teeth into. <laughs> okay, you ready? I'll just take multiple bites. <gasps> oh. Mm. Oh my gosh. That is so good. Don't forget this. I forgot to tell you. This is, what is um, this? it's our mango habanero sauce. It's oh, hot, no. but it's really good. It's got a lot of flavor. It's just a drop. Just a drop? Okay. Yeah. Can you put a drop on mine? She's like shaking. Oh dear. Oh, nicely done. Nicely done. Perfect. Spicy sauce. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. It's good, right? It, I mean, the mango is so good. It's just if you don't like spicy, mm, it's got. Spicy. I told you. Oh, I like it's it. Spicy, <laughs> it's not that bad. Guys, it's like a mouthful of flavors. Like you got a little bit of like this like nice spice to it, and then you have. The pico de gallo with the lime flavor and corn. And then you avocado. have the plantain with the sweet and the coleslaw as like sweet limey. So now I'm super excited to put our own twist on the Tropic Truck. I don't know how we're gonna make something better than this. I don't know, but this we'll is really try. good. Yeah, it'll be hard. <laughs> okay, so I got my mahi mahi right here and I'm ready to start making my wrap and make it better than her which most likely won't be better because she keeps winning everything. I have never made mahi before. I've made tilapia, but I've only done it on like a pan and put it in the oven. So you're just gonna squirt a little bit of clarified butter right there and then we're gonna toss the fish on there. Toss the fish. Nice. Boom. Now we're gonna let it sear for about a minute. Nice, perfect. Here's your mojo. You want to give it a good shake because there's lots of spices in there. Nice. Perfect. Okay. All right. Now just douse it. Yeah. Exactly. See? Do you think it's done? Yeah, it's good. Oh. That's how oh. we're going to put it in the wrap. So here's your rice if you want to grab some. Yes, let's grab some rice. Here's your little rice spoon. So how much rice? Um, Maybe two of those. Two of those? Yeah, two. Not too much, because you're you're gonna put fish and lots of stuff in there. It's doing an okay job so far. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so now I would do the fish next. And I just put it in there? Yeah, just you can just pick it up. We put like we put a whole fillet on there because we're like kind of crazy. But yeah, it, it fits. See, it's good, good size, like that. Okay. I want a limey feel to it. And then I have this salsa rosa over here if you want to put a little bit of, I know one of you guys wanted to put a little bit of that on. Do you want me to put a little on there for you? Just a tiny? I'll, you got it? I'll be careful. Don't put Be careful. It might burn <laughs> your mouth. I'm like really scared. No okay, so now I want some pico. Now I just have to wrap it. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Good luck. Take the, take the sides in first like this. Like this. this. And then use your thumbs to pull it up, and then use your pinkies to scoot this towards you. Uh huh. Did nice. I, did I do it? Yeah. It looks okay. Look, I'm so happy about this. Beautiful. It looks good. I picked out my fish, nice and special. Okay, now I need to season it. I'm gonna put some butter. My fish fillet. I'm getting some rice. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Take some beans. All right. My beans. I think this is looking fantastic. Put the fish on like that. Oh, I don't know how you did it for hers, but I'm going to. Yeah, no, that's fine. Uh, 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 there you go. <laughs> now I'm going to put some. Lime coleslaw on it. 
just some right there. So, and I'm gonna put a little bit of pico. Alright, here we go. I'm cutting the avocado. Ooh. Okay, so here's mine. Look how pretty it looks. Let's see you fold it. Alright, I'm going to try to fold it. How does she fold it? So like this. And then... Okay. Ooh! I think I did it. Ooh. Wanna slice it? Yeah, I'll slice it. You did at an angle, right? Look at it! So these look delicious, but I have to taste them to know which one is better. Mine is huge compared to yours. Yeah, mine's like a little baby! Mine is gonna <laughs> fill more stomachs, just saying. It's hard because this one has a spicy mango that I love, and this one has avocado, so it's like... <gasps> the Vamahi wrap. Because it's Vanessa Mahi, you know? Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sure, I'll try some. Very fresh. Mm. It is fresh. Mm. Super fresh. <laughs> it really good. Mine is called the Ma Heat. Ma Heat. Nice. <laughs> I Nicely done. Right. If I don't win this, I at least I win the pun contest. For sure. Something about the mango, it just makes everything pop. You, can you taste it? The mango in there? It's good, right? So in your opinion, who do you think tastes better? Okay. Well, I okay, this is hard. I love I love both of them. You guys did a good job. You even cooked the fish on the grill and everything. Very, Thank you. very impressive. Thank you. No burns, no emergency room. Good. Wow. Um if I have to pick, I think I have to pick no. this one because the mango the habanero it's like makes really everything. Good. She just put the perfect amount. I saw her, I thought she was being like a little crazy, but she put the perfect amount. Yours is super fresh because you put the lime on it. Oh yeah, yeah. So, I, it tastes really good. Yeah, limey. With the yummy. limey coleslaw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very tropical. Okay, so we're switching. We're going to taste each other's. I'm excited. Here One, two, three. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. So I really like mine because it has this really fresh taste to it with a little bit of kick. It's like spicy, but like mango sweet, but like still really spicy. And then you have like the beans in that rice. The rice is really good. Yeah, I think that really adds good. a lot of flavor to it's it. I feel like it tastes like, it's very citrusy. It has like a lot of lime taste to it, and especially with the pico and avocado. Thanks to the Tropic Truck, and thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe and let us know what food trucks you want to see us get on next time. Bye! Bye.